need you. Now. Don't look at me like that. What's she up to? Give me one of those. I have no idea. It's none of our business, obviously. I bought Cassie's share of the beacon. It seems like our major supplier is taking advantage. I mean, the cost of the, of the restaurant is just, everything is going up, and it was her job to deal with it. Hold on! If dealing with this guy was Cassie's job, why didn't you ask her? Why'd you come to me? Your friend. I thought you could help are you, me. Are you my friend? Yes, I'm your friend. Then why are you trying to ruin my relationship with my son? OK, what's going on with you and Dad? See, he won't talk to me either. Is it Olivia? Is that what this is about? Why would you say that? Because I saw Daddy talking to Olivia, and then you came in the room, and if I didn't know better, I'd say you were jealous of your own father. Really? Wonder why. You think I'm deliberately trying to come between you and Frank? Are you? No, it's the last thing in the world I want, Buzz. I just came to a friend for help. Unless you don't want to be my friend anymore. Is that the case? I'm... No, no. That isn't... I... I gotta fix things with Frank. And every time we start getting close, he walks in and we're talking, and that sets him back. Well, then I better go, hadn't I? Olivia, I... Oh. I trusted Dad to help me. And Olivia's the first woman to come around in a long time that I've actually had feelings for. Yeah, uh, about that. You know, she's beautiful, she's smart, she's funny, and she's a good mom. Yeah. I, she comes with a lot of baggage, though, don't you think? Who doesn't have baggage? I'm not afraid of that. I know. You know Dad pushed us together. You asked him for help. Yeah, well, you know what? I feel like a fool. No. Yes, you know what? And he treated me like... Like his son? Like he put your feelings first? We're in love with the same woman. Oh. Hello, I'm having a little problem with that okay, right okay, now. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> yell it. You guys can work it out. I mean, you have to work it out, Frank. Yeah, really, do we? Yes, you do. Because I think we both know that love comes and goes. But you got one father. And it took us long enough to get him back. You can't push him away now. You need him. We need him. You gotta fix this, Frank. I don't know, sis. Frank! This is weird. This is really weird. Fix it. You gotta fix it. Do it. I'll do what I can. Thanks. Hey, Pop. Hey, Frank. Listen, I was uh, hoping to... I'm a little to... busy right now, so... Uh... Yeah, well, it's important. All right. I think we both need to kind of find a way to dig deep down in and try to get past this whole mess, you know? Because obviously we both care one hell of a lot about Olivia. But we really shouldn't let the situation come between us here. Hmm. Was she here? Oh, damn it, damn it. I didn't want this to happen. Just, I didn't want. Th yes, she was here. Where are you going? I'm talking well, she to you. She came and went and we talked, all right? Okay, so I don't have a problem with you talking to Olivia Day. Talking doesn't bother me. Well, make a list of what bothers you and tell me, and I'll try to avoid it. Okay, quit running away, because you know what? Right, right now, I need some fatherly advice. What? Oh, you know, because see, there's a guy out there that has the hots for my girlfriend. I don't have the hots for her, Frank. Don't lie to me, I'm Pop. not lying, Frank. You're acting like Tell a third exactly how you know what think. you want Stop to do it. with this. What are you people, crazy? Sorry about this. You have a family that most people would kill for. So when are you gonna stop taking it for granted? Olivia. Quiet. You too. You. You have got to get over it, Frank. I mean, your father and I, one time, okay? And it was before we even started dating. And since then, this has been exclusive. You want to see where this goes next? You make up with a man and move on. And you, you were way too smart about people in life to be walking around all day grumbling. So your son is mad at you, so what? That's relationships, folks. Okay, it ain't all sunshines and valentines. It's good times and bad times. It's peaks and valleys. And when you're in a valley, you change it. Change it. And the most important thing, Stop making me suffer because the two of you can't figure out a way to fix this, all right? 
You fix it, or I'm going back to the spawning house where things are peaceful and quiet! Well, I guess we know where she stands. Guess so. She's something else. She certainly is.